You want the special sauce, the super special sauce, the secret sauce, or the chunky sauce? Yeah, we're out of that. Here's your food. <laughs> Sorry. Welcome to Majestic Burger, where we put the fud in the bud. Can I help you? We'll have a number four. With hash browns, hold the onions. I'm on break. Uh, no onions? Ningunia cebolas, por favor? Hello? Just the hash browns? Hmm. This isn't on the schedule. What department are you from? These people are not meant to die now. I don't think you understand what I'm trying to say. I don't think you understand. Hey, let's go already. I'm gonna pickle if this takes much longer. I've had my cocoon for hours. Only because you took mine. You found another one, snitch. Dead Guppy has discovered quite a specimen as well. Indeed, it appears that DJ and Pandora are the last to acquire a cocoon. And the last one back gets the tab at Majestic Burger. No, and frankly, it's unnatural. Quite. It's not the kind of behavior you expect from your typical fungus. Hey, people with cocoons. Let's roll. We can monitor their progress via our new communicators. It will allow us to see and hear everything. To our calculations, you can get extra lift if you swing your weapon. We've ascertained that the mushrooms are most dangerous at close range. Seize your guns. Blam, blam.
just finished building a teleporter. It's only working on inanimate objects right now. Perhaps we can send crates to you filled with goodies. Try jumping, and then using your weapon to launch yourself up there. Hey, look at all the pretty fireflies. Fireflies usually run from you. I don't know what this stuff is, but it seems attracted to us. Strange energy that is magically drawn to you is bound to be good, right, Smith? I concur. In fact, I would hypothesize that these particles must come from somewhere. Perhaps a yellowish pod. What are we looking for? Uh, we're finding cocoons to learn more about meta... metamorpho... what's this? Yes, metamorphosis. The process whereby the average transforms into the outstanding. Like caterpillars into butterflies, man into cockroach. Fascinating. We just need to hike into the woods and cut one down. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, I don't know. Every time you have one of your ideas, I end up getting grounded. We'll both be grounded if you fail biology class. Our reading suggests the malicious fungi are somehow supporting the new metaphors that are blocking your path. Translation, kill the mushrooms to open the root door. Did it! The roots blocking the way have receded.
CJ. Today is the day before we fail biology. Actually, you know, today is. Hey, do you see what I see? I saw it first. Yo, mama saw it first. She did? Protecting that cocoon or something. Protecting it from your ten thumbs. <laughs> it's worth an A for sure. That sucker sure is big. <laughs> the picture on the box. You, do you have any ID 
idea what you've done. I shall rain down destruction so fierce, you will wish you were back in middle school. Uh, but we still are in middle school. For flinching. Need some minions. Stat. I can't believe we got flinched off a cliff. Let us never speak of this again. Pandora! Okay. I don't think anything's broken. Where am I? We're studying the area. We'll let you know as soon as we've triangulated your position. Oh, uh, man. Didn't that creature remind you of Mrs. Nature's daughter, Fury? I don't know, but she's clearly got issues. Yeah, we were out trick-or-treating at Mrs. Nature's house last Halloween, and her daughter, Fury, was threatening us about someday the size of her evil and her evil minions and blah, 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 blah. So, uh, where are we anyway? How do we get back to the sawmill? Don't know, but there's only one way to find out. Intriguing. It's a kind of contraption designed to bar your way. And it appears there may be some sort of object that allows you to open it. Gotta be a switch around here. Preliminary tests indicate those cables are strong enough to hold your weight. Try grabbing a hold of it with your, uh, weapon. It's the old toy cemetery! Who would be lame enough to bury their toys? Uh, well... Warrior.
mechanism has all the complexity of a child's toy to a mind such as mine.
Doll. I thought you said burying toys was lame. She was more than a friend. Listen, you need to destroy that doll's head. If you do, I think we can open a portal for you. Thank <laughs> you. 